Look everything away when we change the roof and then the pit dried out, we opened the wall here and uh, we made a new barrel room. So we have some already oh, some wooden barrels. But this is more kind of an experiment with the university to analyze the effect of wood aging on beer in general. And uh, we'll start adding our four barrels here, port wood uh, whiskey barrels and our Madeira barrels here in, uh, in these rooms. Nice. Where's all the old bottles? Sorry? Where's all the old bottles? Where's all the old bottles? The old bottles of the brewery, we yeah. track them out. <laughs> we have another basement. We have another basement with all bottles and everything. It's too humid here to keep bottles. Uh, the nice thing about this uh, basement here is that we have quite constant temperature. So it's always uh, quite low, so it's good for the aging of the beer on the wooden barrels. We don't get um, we, we, we won't produce a lot of acidic acidity here in the, this basement here. So what are these? These are just tested with uh, cadets on there, just test for university. It's nothing, uh, it's not a beer that we go to commercialize. Three different types of wood, uh, just for analysis. Mm -hmm. This is where the bottles were, or yeah, the bottles, uh, were, the bottles here. were here. Before. You can always tell with the old ceilings. You know, you're an old building where you got this. Yeah. Yeah. Very cool. Some very old kegs, right? Yeah, they're aluminum. Kegs. 1965. <laughs> nice. 1961. We use them one day as decoration or something. That's why we've kept. To ship to throw them away, it's going to be oh, nice yeah. if we can uh, incorporate them yes. in the bar, the brew house in the future. We'll see. Yeah, it's history. Yeah. Nice. In the Kelder van, it would be sell. <laughs> in Kelder. You could have imagined a lot of things when you would, when you 